Today in After Effects, we're going to be taking a look at creating gradients with multiple colors. Now in programs like Photoshop and Illustrator, multicolor gradients are easy to make, but in After Effects they get a little bit trickier. So let me show you what I mean. Here on stage I have a new document, and the first thing that I'm going to do is go up to Layer, then down to New, and then over to Solid, and create a new solid that is comp size. So now that we have that, I'm going to go over to my Effects and Presets window and search for an effect called a ramp. Now when I find that, you can just take and drag that onto your solid. Now ramps are the effect used to create gradients in After Effects, so you will see the gradient immediately applied, but we'll notice that there are only two available colors in the settings. Now in order to get more control over the gradient and ability to add more colors, you will need to search for the effect called Colorama and drag it to your solid. Now in the Colorama effect, I'm going to open up the output cycle and you can see exactly where all of these colors are being generated from. Now this interface works exactly like any of the other gradient sliders you're already familiar with. So you can click and drag a node away from the circle to remove it. You can click the circle and select a color to add one. And you can slide the various colors around and adjust their overall opacity in the gradient. So I'm going to just go ahead and remove most of these nodes and then create a few of my own. So the interface does take a little bit of time to get used to, but once you get the hang of it, you can use it pretty quick. Now since we essentially control the gradient and the color separately, feel free to also adjust the endpoints of the ramp effect or any of the other settings to get exactly what you're looking for. So lastly, one fun setting in the Colorama effect is the cycle repetition setting. So if you ever need to create a repeating gradient, go ahead and turn up the cycle repetitions value to have that process automated for you. So that about wraps it up for multicolor gradients and After Effects. So as always, if you enjoyed this After Effects tutorial, be sure to subscribe, rate, comment, and share it with your friends.